Let's go! Yang Chen is technically the youngest fully realized avatar in history. At the age of 17. You got that right. Aang is the only avatar in history to die twice. Good job, dude. How's that a fun fact? Don't interrupt me, I'm doing a thing. Korra has been arrested more than any other avatar. Avatar Zito is the first known lava bender. Kyoshi is the only known person to ever glass bend. No one even knows how she learned it. Kurok basically looked like a walking corpse by the time he died due to all his injuries and the spiritual consequences of slaying spirits. I'm not gonna show that though. It was really bad. Korra is the youngest avatar to ever be revealed, being only about five years old when she was first recognized. Yang Chen got banished from the Northern Air Temple. She never brings it up, but she messed up really bad. One, I swear to God. She got a lot of people killed. Aang is the only avatar to learn how to redirect lightning. And Kyoshi is the only avatar to fail at redirecting lightning. Okay, Wan, enough. Korra brought back the Air Nation by complete accident and had no idea that would happen. Wan, these aren't fun facts. Roku is the only known avatar to die in combat. Sort of. Okay, Juan, you've said enough. Nah, I'm gonna keep going. Juan, stop this silly game. I can see what you're doing. You know what? You guys don't respect me nearly as much as I deserve. You're gonna learn to respect me. Juan, stop being stupid. Let's just... Next avatar that talks is gonna get it. Juan, come on. Yang Chen got cock-blocked. Wow. He was not joking. Korra didn't defeat a single major villain alone. I mean, I could've... I don't know, Korra. Vatu was kind of handling you. Kyoshi likes to talk all big, but she was the sub in her own relationship. I wonder how long it took you to come up with that. A fairly long time. I see. Hey, Roku, you got anything you want to say? Nothing to say to our good pal Juan over here? Weather's quite nice, isn't it, Roku? You suck. <laughs> It took Aang longer than any avatar in history to become fully realized, being over a century old and all. That doesn't count! Yes, it does, dude. Get over it. Korra is the first avatar to ever use metal bending. Kyoshi is the first avatar to ever fire bend with her mouth. Not much of a surprise there. Kurok was the best pie show player in history. Like, this man did not lose. You know I ain't about that life. Man, it's just a game. You know I ain't about that life. Yang Chen was the only avatar able to use airbending powered screaming. And before you say it, no, Aang never did this. I probably could have if I tried. And you may be like, oh, but Avatar 1, Aang used airbending screaming when he was trapped with Zuko. No! I mean, I sort of did. No, you're wrong. If that was the same as Yang Chen's technique, you would have blown Zuko's head off. I still think I could have done it. Roku's Dragon Fang is the only animal companion ever seen in the spirit world. Aang is the first avatar to use spirit bending. In her search for Yun, Kyoshi ran out of leads, so she kidnapped a Fire Nation official and his mother. Then she threatened to drop his mother off a cliff unless he told her where Yun was. Yeah, not my proudest moment. He literally had no idea where Yun even was. Well, I thought he did. Yang Chen is the only avatar to ever physically enter the spirit fog. Wait, Yang Chen, you actually went in there? I was looking for somebody. Who were you looking for? Don't worry about it. Well, now you got me curious. That's unfortunate. So who was it? Nobody. Tell me. I'm not telling you anything. Please? No. Yang Chen, come on. I just want to know. Don't pester me, child. Sorry, but is this called Yang Chen and Korra argue about stupid stuff? Or is it called Fun Facts with Wan? Sorry, Wan. Mm. Damn. Chen, you all right? I'm fine. You don't seem fine. I'm just peachy. Really? Is this about how Juan exposed you again? Kyoshi, he did not expose me. None of that was even true. Well, the evidence is right there, girl. I'm surprised you can still even deny this anymore. It's just the natural effect the Water Tribe has on airbenders. It's like they can't control themselves. Oh my god. Thanks, guys! Thanks for completely ruining my flow with this. My pleasure. The people want more. Oh, great. Please, no. Please, yes. Juan, aren't you running out of things to say? Who are you talking to right now? Because it's not me. Juan, just stop. Round three, baby. Korra is the only avatar to ever kill a member of her own family. Hey, I didn't kill him. I just... Korra, you literally deleted his soul. I think that's even worse. I think that's even better. Yeah, thanks, Kyoshi. Aang has spent more time in the avatar state than any other avatar. Kyoshi's first kiss was Rangi. Well, yeah. Obviously. But it was almost Yun. Dude! Wonder if Rangi ever knew about that. Wan, you little- Yang Chen first learned waterbending on an island off the coast of the Fire Nation. Oh, here we go. I'm pretty sure they named the island after her and everything. Just say it already. Kurok sank it. He sank the whole thing. Kyoshi, Korra, and Yang Chen are the only avatars known to ever use healing with waterbending. Kyoshi is the only avatar to consistently fight with weapons. Unless you want to count Aang's staff, but you know. It's time for stabbing. Kurok once tried to confess his love for a woman through a letter. Dude, really? She was already married. It was complicated. You tried to steal someone's wife. How is that complicated? I still blame Yang Chen. Of course. Also, Yang Chen, I want to apologize about my comment about you getting denied action in the bedroom. 
It wasn't appropriate. Yeah, I'm not falling for that. Since it happened to Cora, too. Oh my god. That sucks. Oh my god. You're 0 for 2, ladies. Come on now. Why? Why do we keep letting him do this? Because it's what the people want. Juan. Just, just shut up. Hey man, don't be mad at me like I'm the one that walked in on you while you were- Okay, okay, okay. Juan, you are never doing one of these again. But they're fun facts. Juan, no one here is having fun. That's not true. It's fun for me. Oh? Well, that's good, because this is the last one you're doing. You can't just stop me. If I want to share my vast experience and knowledge, then that's what I'll do. So that's how you're going to be? Yeah, I guess it is. You know, you can still stop. I'm not going to stop. You sure about that? Oh, I'm definitely sure. All right, then. I'll stop. All right, we're doing this again. Juan, do you have a death wish? I'm already dead. What about Kiyoshi? Screw Kiyoshi. I'm telling her you said that. That was a reflex. I'm telling her. Please don't. Yang Chen invented an airbending technique that completely extinguishes combustion bending. Wait, she what? I was getting really sick of those goddamn combustion benders. Why did you never tell me? You never asked. What? Korra is the first avatar to ever use the, uh, spirit banishing technique. Juan, what the hell did you even just say? I forget what it's called. Definitely not that. Fine. Let's just call it the thing Kuruk really wanted to use but couldn't figure out how. Why are you such an ass? I don't like to be corrected. Kyoshi has threatened both the Earth King and the Fire Lord, respectively. Aang has a scar on his back and on his foot because of how electricity works. The headpiece Roku wears was given to him by Fire Lord Sozin. One that is common knowledge. He still wears it in the spirit world, even after everything Sozin did. It's very fashionable. That is so screwed up. But I like it. Dude, take it off. No. Kuruk and Yang Chen are the only two avatars that have never really lost a fight. Damn right. Zito too, technically. Wait, you're saying Kiyoshi actually lost a fight? Well... That Zhu guy sort of beat her, and she got ambushed and paralyzed that one time. Does getting ambushed really count? Yang Chen got ambushed once, and she just one-shot everybody. But they didn't try to paralyze her? You really think that would have made a difference? Fair enough. Aang is the only Avatar to ever successfully fight off a volcano. He only used one element, by the way. He was also 12. One, I get it. Take off that lunatic's headpiece. No, it's mine. It's so screwed up that you're still wearing it. It's stylish. Kuruk's fight with Father Glowworm was so intense that he nearly tore a hole between the spirit world and the- Juan, this is old news. We already know this. What? How is this old news? Don't worry about it. Cora, how do you know about that? It was referenced. What are you even talking about? Uh, nothing. When the hell was it ever referenced? Cora, don't tell him. I won't. Don't tell me what? You know, you really think the spirit world would be large enough for me to not hear your constant whining. What's up, Kiyoshi? Hello, Juan. So... Cora, how bad were the facts this time? They actually weren't that bad this time. Did he say anything stupid? I don't know. Does spirit banishing technique count as stupid? What the hell is a spirit banishing technique? You tell me? Oh my god, that thing, you know? Like when she's all like, go in peace and just obliterates your soul. That's not what that does. There is no afterlife for that guy. Well deserved, if you ask me. Kiyoshi, aren't you upset he went behind your back and did this again? Dude, why would you say that? Aang, I just, I just can't even be bothered right now. Let the man talk about his shenanigans for all I care. Girl just couldn't resist the fun facts. Juan, don't push it. Sorry.